Ever wondered what the life of a campaign tracker is like? Rushing from one political event to another, eating in your car? And then you remember what happened to Siddharth, that fellow called Makaka by George Allen? Of course, Allen has a tracker on web too, you know. Here he is. Now I'm the new Siddharth, the new Makaka, taking over tracker duties for the web campaign at the Shenandoah Airport in northwestern Virginia. Now, everyone knows just how much trouble the Allen campaign got into the last time they picked on a tracker, but some people just don't learn. Allen flew into the small regional airport to greet a handful of supporters and a couple of local news crews and me. Someone from the campaign asked who I was, and I told them my name, that I was Jim Webb's tracker, just as I was instructed to do by the Webb campaign. And if asked to leave, I would have. But they didn't ask me to leave. Instead, this is what happened. I shoot Alan's pitch, and I'm shooting the pressing the flesh part of the ritual when this doofus gets in front of my camera. I don't think much about it. I change positions. A couple of minutes later, the same guy is in my shot. Rats, I move again. And then, he's there again. Oops, I think he might be doing this on purpose. So, I move to the other side of the room. And a couple of minutes later, there he is again. What is this guy afraid of? What is Alan saying that he doesn't want me to record? I'm really curious now, and I think to myself, could this be Allen's campaign manager, Dick Wadhams? He looks like Dick Wadhams. He moves like Dick Wadhams. No, he's younger, but he's definitely a staffer. Hmm, I'm really starting to get tired of his shoulder in my shot, so I decide to shoot the famous George Allen cowboy boots. But Doofus isn't about to let me get that shot and stands right in front of my camera. So, I move again. And there he comes again. Well, sometimes there's a price to pay for standing in front of a camera. Enjoy this close-up of Doofus's bald spot.